Here we are with the plucky squire. I hope this game is gonna throw me some more bones to play with though because uh, it has been really like it just it, it felt like a really old Zelda game, but Polished to like the max with uh, new graphics You said you would stream until 1 p.m. Yeah, um, a.m. I mean Damn <laughs> That's probably because I uh, I mean my, my brain just not uh, like You know completely active right now It's close to like bedtime for most people here. So I mean it uh, feels like it so This is unknown territory kiddos Oh, yeah jot your story has never taken to this area. So you have script now. I think I read this before last time All right, let's go So, apparently this game is like 7 to 10 hours long, so, suppose that's okay. It's from what Donnie says, he says 10 hours, but I've seen play long plays from like 7 hours as well, so. Look at the size of that. Big, gnarly, uh thing a minor join tomorrow stream depending on how much you do compared to how much I play well I will start in the evening so uh, I mean probably like nine o'clock because it's a Zelda game those will take like a little longer to like do parts on so most most when I do Zelda games, it's most likely like three hours something around that So yeah, um, but yeah, I'm looking I'm, I'm looking forward to it I haven't, I haven't looked too much into the I, on purpose. I didn't look too much into uh, echoes of wisdom Because it is already like a top-down Zelda, you know So it's already For me, it's it's not like I don't like it as much, but it's it's less exciting than something like uh, a 3D one, like a Tears of the Kingdom, or maybe like just traditional Zelda game. So that's why you know I'm not looking into m too much, so I can be surprised. That's pretty much all. Metroid Prime Four sucks. I'm pretty sure that's gonna be amazing. This insect nest broke through the ground and tense the flew the bugs. Really not a fan of these plunky punky bugs. I tried Link's Awakening. I liked Link's Awakening, didn't feel like a 60 year old game. That's because it's an old game, you know, it's like a Game Boy <laughs> game, so it's not supposed to be. I mean, for a Game Boy game, that was impressive. I'm not gonna lie. I'm kinda hungry though. I'm gonna eat some apple cake. Like Is that a pure Dutch thing, by the way? Apple pie cake? Apple cake? I don't think it is, right? Some apple cake, like, real quick. I'm, like, fucking hungry, dude. Hello, little goblin. I have a task for you, my rotund purple friend. Concerning with wretched squire. Uh, but squirrel? What, what the fuck? I don't know. Jesus, I booted him out of the book, you know, but it's a persistent little creep He may still be out there with an eye on causing humgrum trouble But you see humgrum will bring the trouble to him. Okay, take a shot of my Meta magic and leap through this pretty portal Shut yourself free of these pages and go bully that wretched past No, it's not an ap apple flop. <laughs> it's actually not. It's 
It's like more like an apple, uh, like apple cake, but like a mini, mini like version of it. No, not a muffin. It's like a cookie. You see the game I put in game chat, by the way? Yeah, but I'm also gonna look at some other people's uh, requests as well, because you have to, like, agree that I can't just do only your requests, you know? Because I've, I've done a lot of your requests, the uh, so... This is, um, well, maybe this is slightly one of them. I don't mean a stream game, okay. I think I've looked at it, I, I, took, I took a glance at it, but it was also creating the stream, so... Um... Yeah, duck side, yes. Yes, I've checked it. Hockey Squire. <laughs> By Elmo. Elmo's like this shit again, I don't know why. Or it's just memeing around, could also be. So we have to go outside of the book, I guess. This must be the portals Moonbeater was talking about. And you, Jot, can just jump right through. Yeah. I can. My whole life is just a plot line. Yes, it is. So is this game. It's just a plot line. Everything is scripted. I just wish I've been written a little more cool. Yeah, you're not really cool. Gotta agree with you on that one. Oh, we can't jump from this page to the other. Okay, so. What if I stick my knife to them? Like, through them? Can I... It's like ground pound. Yeah. So am I supposed to go this way because he is somewhere over here? Out of cutscenes, it looks like Dora, a Dora adventure game. Rick's height, IRL, of course. Yeah, I'm as small as a table right now. I'm as small as as the guy on the table. Actually me. Like what I what I mean is just like there's just not a whole lot here. Like I have a feeling I might need, uh, might need to just jump in here then. Even though there was a cutscene of one of these creatures walking out. Is this gonna, is this, uh, okay, tell me, Donnie, to save me some, some, um, hopefully not disappointment with this game. Is it gonna throw me some other, like, uh, mechanics than just this? Yes? 
Okay, don't spoil- don't spoil what it is, but I just wanted to know that, because... Right now it feels very, like, uh... How do you say that? Ein- eintonig? In, uh, Dutch. One side, like, I don't know. It's just collect key, go door. Generic, yeah. It, the concept isn't generic, but then the gameplay is, uh, to me, right now. As simple as that. I really wonder what it's like out there. That's why I said, uh, so far it's a little on the boring side, but maybe it'll, it'll like, kick up. To something else. I don't know. Uh, give me some, like, dungeons. Some massive puzzle dungeons where you're, where you're like, can waste hours in. Or, like, at least an ha half an hour in. Mike, my bitch! <laughs> Dungeons aren't puzzly. Oh, that's a shame. I love the dungeons. I love the dungeons in Link's Awakening, actually. I thought they were really good. That's why I'm looking forward to the new Zelda game. I, I, I kind of like the top-down ones as well. I don't like them as much as the 3D ones, but sometimes I'm just in for it. That's why, because this game is a lot like top-down Zelda games. That's why I was like, should I play this today? Because it might... Uh, bring the mood down for tomorrow But I think I'll be fine I do really want to play that metroidvania game though you should yeah, I don't know if you've looked at the the trailer like the video of that steam page I, I've like played in the I only walked around um, In the like starting area. I didn't do anything yet in that game, I only like walked around to see how it felt and shit before I commit to like an entire playthrough. And I was like, okay. You like unlock new moves for the character with like in a Metroidvania way, so like new sort of jumps and all that kind of stuff. I was like, okay, this is pretty good. And it's only f like four or five bucks, six bucks maybe. Some breath of the wild shrines need big brain power. There were there were a lot of a um, lot of ones that are actually difficult. What was that character though? I bet that's why you, I, I bet I knew you were gonna say something like that. I mean, yeah, it's it's uh, a goat lady, I think. From what I've seen, it looks like a goat lady. She reminded me of that one character from Undertale, but like thinner. Uh, what was the character's name? Like the, the the goat lady you got introduced to first. I don't know the exact name, uh, but you can. Toriel, yeah, a little bit. But thinner and and uh, thicker. <laughs> I don't know what the other ones had. I have to actually pay attention. A huge bug sat in the middle of the...
the word tiny. I don't see tiny though. The ruins were just full of bugs. Oh, I thought observed was the one I had to... I think a huge gate so I can pass through the bars, maybe? Or no. Okay. Well, not sure. But yeah, I'm I'm ignoring the character design of that game because the actually the gameplay is like is like from what I've heard is it's it's like S tier. Let's see what's over here. Also, it's not like the game like combines it with humans and shit. So it's just like a female platform character in the form of like a goat. <laughs> Yeah, if I, if I knew that game, um, I've seen the game, like, um, last year, but I didn't pay a lot of attention to it. That's probably a mistake, because that game is probably gonna be pretty good. Big old moat full of water. You might be able to access somewhere useful. What oat? Big full of what? A full bug. I don't think I've seen a game before. Yeah, I've seen it too. That's what I mean. I'm like, I've seen it before, but I never thought it was it was that good. Like, um, I never really imagined it to be that good, but apparently it is. So what exactly do I need to do here? Like, how do I get... I'm missing stairs, yeah. But... Can I move the stairs then? Have I tried to portal net? No, I haven't. Thank you. 
Okay, so now I have water, but what does that do? Down the moat. Definitely doesn't work. Good night, uh, Dovin. Drain the box, but it doesn't do anything. Close the bug. <laughs> Doesn't work. Let's just fucking jump over this guy. Okay. So like some fucking words around here or something? No words in the 3D area. I could take the word away, right? Can I take the word? I have to fucking actually go inside the goddamn thing. I get it. Hold on. The point. Uh, yeah, I don't. I, okay. The thing is, I'm not stupid. It's just that I probably misread what the objective was. I have to go in here. Okay. Well, now I know what to do. Hold on. If I, if I. No, it's not excuses. I don't, I don't know. Fuck. What the fuck? The word moat. I'm like, what the hell is a fucking moat? <laughs> I 
like, dude, I never use word um, word like moat. Okay. Now I know. There you go. We granted again, and now I should be able. Oh wait, hold on. Yeah, gracht. Yeah. I mean, but I, when do you use that word in English? You barely. Really? Why can I not jump off that? Don't annoy me, man. Come on, let's go. You can jump off. Well, that. Oh, that's what the like little edge is for. Yeah, you, they should have just made it so you can jump off everything. It's your own fault if you do, right? And can I also jump up that way? No, I can't. Okay, so huge frog, what now? Tiny, huge frog, tiny bug, I guess. Eat it. Eat the bug, please. Get it out of- oh, okay. Useless frog. I already knew I could change it, okay? Just give me- give me something new than- than flipping around words. Please. Spin attack badge. Jump attack. Let's no. Let's get the spin attack. Sure. Actually, go over here. Okay. Don't forget the artwork. No money. Oh, you're gonna be kidding me, right?
how much of this is there, by the way? This, like these puzzles, a lot of, <laughs> isn't it? Isn't there? Like a lot of them are word based, aren't they? Yeah, one. There's no fucking point to like worth that. Oh boy. I never would have uh, gone that way, so. Well, maybe, maybe it's handy to first look what the goddamn sentence is. I'm already getting. Hold on. The walkway was. Oh, wait. Uh, huge lily pad floated on the water, I guess. Work with me. If this is like 90% or 80% of what I have to do in the game, I'm gonna get so sick of it. <laughs> You're not gonna believe. That's huge, all right. Thanks. Okay. Look over there. Flippering, foundering fish. My fish now. Or not. Jot cleared his mind. Now he was ready to grab the fish. Okay. Oh, of course, with the triggers. Can I move the hand? Really? I fucking punch that fish's guts out before I grab it. How how is that not a hit? Wait. There we go. Fish grabbed. The plucky squire gently released the fish into the water. What do you mean? No, no, uh, fish sticks? And there, it regained its composure. Oh, damn it. Thank you so much, noble traveler. 
My name is Flo Floatio. Flo Floatio. Now I'm a fish. Green lightning zapped me right out of these waters. Consumed by fear, I flipped and flopped. Till by your hand, my fugue was stopped. <coughs> Jesus. I'm eternally in your debt. You must forgive me. I must go. For my beloved swims this reedy fen. And I can not rest till we meet again. Okay. Safe travelers, my noble saviors. But... Goodbye, fish. One extremely well-spoken fish. I do hope he finds his love. I don't. I hope he ends up in my grocery bag. <laughs> no, I'm just... I'm just no, okay. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Our heroes ventured off. <laughs> the sounds of the daytime chorus began to fade. And the light began to dwindle. Alright. I think you, people watching can kind of tell I'm kind of like tired as well, so... Yeah, man. Swamps are kind of moody at night. Check out those singing frogs. Sweet harmonies. These are the frogs Alex Jones were talk was talking about, I think. Oh. God, please. Do does this need to be? The bridge was broken. Okay, what fucking bridge? I don't see a bridge here. Oh, it is bridge. Okay. So. It was now night in the swamps. Okay. So let me guess, this is just gonna be a, a big time backtracking sh shit with words right now. I have to fucking flip the book. Wait, the bridge was broken, right? And it was now night in the swamps, so I have to make it somehow. I have to make it day, I guess. So, maybe the bridge is not open? I don't know. Nah. Can I go all the way back? can't okay um It's gonna work. I might have done all of this for nothing, but
Okay. So... Oh wait, there's a thing here. Dreamcast symbol. Okay. Now move a fucking side. Backseat. What do you mean backseating? Okay, my God, man. Bastard. It made the bug buff. Well, I just, uh, am I supposed to go down here? Let's find out. That just ejects you from the book, okay. Let me check the rest of the page. Is there something I have to pick up from over here? Yep, there is.
Okay. Oh wait, it's just uh, like a wall between between. These are some baby, baby puzzles, man. First puzzle without words. <laughs> I just don't hope that, I hope that that's just not gonna be like... but I just hope that that's not gonna be the rest of the game just constantly like doing words like crosswords <laughs> puzzles I, I don't I want some variety in it can't read that right now I'm eating Uh, I can I can throw my sword. Bow and arrow. You're a mage, right? Or like a witch, whatever you are. Do your thing. Make things float. Are you actually gonna do it? Actually not useless, okay. Okay. I'm digging it. Guacamole. It's a big log. Hey, I mean, she said it. Not really a long-range weapon, unless you threw it. Portal. You know, I get the feeling there won't be a weapon just lying around the swamp. I mean, have you ever seen a snail rocking a crossbow? I haven't. Maybe you'll find something out there in the other realm. Okay. Well, maybe, but what? what nothing really changes here, does it? I mean... Yeah, okay, it's day now, but... First quotation mark dungeon. Oh, okay. You consider these dungeons, so there aren't actually any dungeons. <laughs> Word up, it's me, Mini Beard. Or to give me your, give you my full name, my talking Mini Beard. I'm toy based on the character. Yeah, okay, I got it. It's a little bit meta, but my advice is very practical. If you're looking for a long range weapon. There's an even elven warrior around here who owns one. She lives in a game cart. Yeah, okay, I saw the game cart. Head up, what's to find her? She might try and shoot you with arrows, but don't make take it personally. How can a cart shoot me? Oh, hello, ringworm. <laughs> Whatever you are. Jot. 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 We meet once more. But alas, it seems that danger is on the horizon. 
Sonnet Swamp's least desirable have extracted themselves from the book. But if it does at least appear that you are suitably equipped this time, eradicate the invertebrates. Game could do it the less dialogue. Yeah, I agree with that. I don't want to do too much reading, actually. Try to get me from here, bitch. What are the what are the scores for um Zelda right now? I'm guessing because it's a top-down one, people are gonna be bitching. And they're gonna give it like an 85 instead of like a 90 or something. My prediction. I mean, 80, 85, I said. 86, oh, it was close. Okay, that's pretty good for a top-down one. What, what, what did Link's Awakening get? Lucky Squire got an 84. Okay. And that is what, what version? This version seems fine, though. The Xbox version. Just overall, or... Is that based off a version of the game? Because this is the Xbox one. Because it just... It's just the easiest to play. Like, a console version is easier. Like, you've just tried to play a PC game. It's sometimes just a mixed bag, depending on the game, so... Like, some games are just not optimized for it. You got a new piece of artwork. Press X to show in gallery. Okay. Concept area. Skeleton. Okay. <laughs> are we meeting Sans here? 87. Oh, so it's better. Damn. You mean like, um, which version of Link's Awakening? The remake? Or the original one? I'm not taking, I'm not taking uh, critics too seriously anyway. It's just fun to look at the scores real quick. Because some, some are reliable, but some, but most of them are just... I guess whatever. Oh, come on. Why you gotta... That's probably my delivery guy. Yep. Giving me like a timestamp. Fits through the fucking door anyway, so who cares? I've had w I, I had like a debate with some uh, like delivery like guy one time. I was like, I, I ordered a Nintendo Switch game and it came in like a, a square box, and it was like, what the hell is this? Because <laughs> I wasn't home, and I said, what do you mean? This is like a video game. Why is it in a square box instead of like a an envelope thing? Like, it makes no sense. And they were also looking at like, yeah, that's kind of weird. Why, why is that in there? Oh, okay. I just had the time to jump correctly. It's a lot of frame skipping, though. Jesus. 
Does the PC version have this as well? The frame skipping. Like the jittery-ish. When, when the camera moves like a little jittery. In the cutscenes and shit. Like it's overall fine. It, it's mostly been smooth the entire ride, but... It better be because it's a goddamn 500 like euro console. It's not even the S version, it's the X one. Like the more expensive one that that's, has better hardware. Why did I get the X? I actually got that before the PlayStation. Not the Xbox, I mean. Some time ago. I've had the Xbox for a while. I think 2020? Or... 2020... The end of 2020 or like 2021, like early 2021. It's just I've been, it's, it has been sitting here and I was like, you know what, let's just fucking use it because... You know, why not? We got it um, on first like glance. I, I got it to play um, my old Xbox 360 games and and kind of new games on like our 4K TV downstairs. So that's where it's been sitting for a while. That's the main reason I got the X version because we have a 4K uh, 4K TV downstairs, so we could play in 4K 60 frames. Or 120 frames, I mean, even. Because that TV has has 120 frames refresh rate, I think. It's like a... Wario Land Virtual Boy when? Is there a non-Virtual Boy color palette for that game? <laughs> Just so I don't go, like, blind. Because of all the red. How must that be for a colorblind person, by the way, if you play a fucking game that's entirely red? How- you got a new piece of artwork, press X to show in gallery. Nice. Like the snake. I mean, the thing with this game is I don't wanna- I don't wanna shit on the games. I, I really don't. The, the concept is, is phenomenal of this game. But so far, it's not, like, in gameplay-wise, it's not really blown me away yet. So, that's kind of what I meant, like, with, you know, what I said. Um, does it need to be here? Also, you asked about um, that, that Metroidvania you requested. Uh, damn it, I already forgot the name again. Um, you, you mentioned it like a thousand times in chat before, but... <sighs> what the fuck was the name? <laughs> what was the name? God damn it, I don't know the name. <laughs> oh, I had a savage, savage beast, planet, whatever. I thought it was, uh, it looks, I don't know, I, I don't know what to make of it when I look at it. Is it a Metroidvania? Is it a survival game? What, what exactly am I dealing with? Like... What the hell? It's not a survival game. I've seen some videos though, like, people bring resources to their... Like, ship and stuff, or whatever. I'm 
Like, I don't know, is this trying to be a Metroidvania or is this trying to be something else completely? Another intruder, I can see uh, leaving a gleam in your eye. It's only for upgrades, okay? Show me what you've got, Rascal. Oh, really? I think this game is trying to be the Plucky Squire game, yes. Uh, it's trying to be Undertale right now, I think. I, am I am I supposed to... I'm not gonna, like... Am I supposed to damage, like, and talk? Like an Undertale? Just spam talk. Dude, I will, I will fucking hit the shit out of you if you keep... Screw you. dying. I just do jack shit. It is I, Paige, the bookworm. You seem to be in a... Yeah. You shall die. I don't need your bow. So what else if I kill her? Am I gonna do genocide run? <laughs> Okay, what if you kill her, though?
<laughs> I genuinely think you could pull her, not gonna lie. <laughs> Champion of this land, striving to defeat the dastardly Hump Grump and put a stop to his mischief. Is that so? Now that I take a closer look at him, he does seem to have somewhat heroic countenance, of course, with his pink, puffy head. And his clothes. Alonia. Alonia. We wholeheartedly apologize for the disturbance we have. We are searching for a weapon to help clean up Humgrom's chaos. Your elven bow seemed like it could ad be adventurous, adventurous in that regard. We did not mean to cause any turmoil in your forest. Dude, shut up. God, your sword is massive. Also, that moan compilation, dude. Actually, if you're here, Astromaniacs, fucking screw you, man. I didn't. I, when I said that yesterday, I didn't say it. Do it immediately. Just don't. Fuck. I don't. I don't want to be out there known as the moan king. What the hell were you thinking, dude? The moan moan king. I helped. Oh, fuck off. Any enemy of Humgrump is a friend of mine. Did you send him clips or something? Or whatever. I can see the R of good about you now, Jot. Exceptional. When the bow has finished assisting you, it will return itself to these forests. Good luck on your quest, young Joth. Our battle was most bracing. Okay. You got the bow. We made a good tag team, don't you think, Jot? So it seems that Humgrom's forces have made their way outside of your book. Yeah, this does not bode well. Here, jump into this sticky note. Now we have to, to get down to the desk and back to your book. Moon Princess for shut up. Okay. Shut up. Shut up, ya. Yeah. He asked for the OG DK Moon, I delivered. Oh, for fuck's sake. Well, it's for out there for everyone to see now. Like it always was, but, uh, like in different streams, but now it's just put all together in one fucking video. I like how that thing is one minute long, by the way. It's like just. At least, like, ten different clips of me making moan sounds. At least make some different ones as well to balance it out. <laughs> Watch the next one being uh, Rick saying sus things. Or something stupid like that, or maybe the duck noises or whatever. That would actually be good, though. Not the moan ones. I got what I was looking for, I think. Where's the ball? There we go, lad. Go wallop him. If only the producer could do so. The Donald Duck mon- Bugs. John oh. Reddy, the elven bow. Okay. It was time to put its powers to the test. Screw you then. 
The sensitivity of these of the stick is like aiming is really goddamn slow. Jot drew his bow back as far as he could. And shot that creature right in the eye. It's like a mix of Zelda and WarioWare. If I have to describe this game. The lucky squire had squashed the bugs. I didn't need to. from the bottom of our mollusk hearts that's not the last of those bugs though we've had word there were more ahead they say their leader is a big horrible bug with flashing eyes have your wits about you adventurers good luck i'm gonna destroy your your belongings let me destroy your teapot. I can't destroy the teapot. Zero out of ten. You've reached Nilford upon a bomb. Nice peaceful town. At least it was. Okay. Oh boy, here we go again. Most unexpected for us to find in these lands. We've read all your books and thrilled at your adventures. We don't get to adventure much ourselves, being snails that is. I once fell in a hole, but I suppose it's nothing compared to your es escap escapades. Gnom Gnomic? You write about them so evocatively, okay? I'm a big fan of your work. Perhaps, oh, perhaps you could help us? Those horrible bugs have trashed our town. And stolen works of great renown, okay? Namely, the two volume collected works of Shakespeare. Nice Shakespeare reference. Lucky Squire. Please defeat the bugs and get those two books back to us. Snail friends were on the case. Of course not, I'm dyslexic. <laughs> you think I'm, I'm good at big words? I had trouble with normal words back in the day. <laughs> I hate people who use big words. They think they're more like they're the fucking smarter when they use big words, but then they don't. Just, just, they just sound stupid. These are ten bucks, bugs, here in the western nook. Defeat them all to collect that book. Okay. Well. Yeah, you can fuck right off, Donny. Here was a stone staircase. Okay. Nay. 
I just want to say, what if it's soft lock now because I threw the words on the on top of the thing? It it both it both like uses the same. button to activate it. I think I fucked it up now. Uh, no, I did not. Hello. Hero mode. No hard drops. Yeah, I, I know. I know what hero mode is. But. Not that I care too much about it. I don't really play games twice. Like, back to back that quickly. Maybe later on, yeah. Rayman 2 because that game is endlessly replayable. Try, I would say try it. It really is a good platformer. Just the fluidness of everything in that game is just amazing. Especially when you try to like, um, hang from ledges, you can like jump right off of it again. Like the first frame you hang on it, you can just immediately jump off. It's just so fluent and shit. If a HD version gets released, I mean, the if you just get the PC one, you can actually drop it into there. There's like an HD uh, version for PC as well. If you like, people like make mods and stuff. I still don't think that's the best version though. I I, lo I love the Dreamcast one so. Like last time we played it, I played it on original hardware, so. Like on a Sega Dreamcast itself. I do hope they uh, do it, but um, have you seen that, by the way? Uh, what I said in, like, Discord? They have um, credited Rayman and, and lots of, like, Ubisoft games in Astrobot. Without it being in there. Which is weird. Because why would you do that? There's no reason to do it. Other than if something 
An Astrobot update got re revealed. Yeah, I saw it, but I didn't see, uh, I was looking at that. I, I didn't see any, like, Rayman thing, so. Yet, but it might be, it might be like a DLC or. The thing is, every si single franchise they mentioned in the credits has gotten something new this year, except Rayman. So. Doesn't have to mean anything, but. Or at least like an, an like a, a port or an HD port like Beyond Good and Evil is also uh, from the makers from Rayman. It's a really good game, by the way. Maybe I'll, I'll, I'll might, might try it out actually someday. I think I actually have it on Xbox. I'm not sure, but um, I have to check at the end of the stream if I have that. I think I do. Um, but yeah, that's also a really good game. But that got an HD collection as well or like an HD version. Or a 4K version, whatever it is. With higher frame rates and all that kind of stuff, yada yada. Um, Assassin's Creed was in the credits, which has a completely new game this year. Uh, Croc? Do you know Croc, the platformer? That's not even Ubisoft related, but that also got a new game this year. So I, I don't know. Croc. I don't know if you know Croc. The crocodile. The one platformer. That's getting like a HD, like port of the first game. I don't know if you know what Croc is. It's that crocodile like platformer. The green like crocodile guy. With his little backpack and shit. Nitro Rat's videos on Croc. Hmm. I got introduced by Nitro Rat because Rayman 2 was also one of his favorite games. Growing up. I think Nitro Rat is also how I um, uh, found that, that uh, Metroidvania game, by the way. That pseudo regalia game I want to play Friday. Or at least Friday or the weekend, depend on... I think it was his favorite game of, of last year. I think. But the only thing I really tried in that game yet today was uh, just walk around. It was his favorite game. It's that good. You know what? I have a feeling, you know, because you you gifted me uh, you you gifted me like Superland, right? If you like it, if you watch me play it and you like it, Friday, I might just because it's only like five bucks, so I can gift it to you if you like it enough. You blasted those caterpillars, man. Yeah, I did. It's probably really difficult, though. I heard that boss fights as well, like, really... It's a difficult platformer. You need a lot of, like, skill jumps and shit. All kinds of wall jumps and stuff. And you unlock those abilities in a Metroidvania way, so... For a muse of fire that would ascend the brightest heaven, okay? Made Kaizo levels in Mario. I mean, just uh, I think I'm not sure if it's Kaizo difficulty, but it's it's 3D, not 2D. So I don't know. I might have some difficulties with that game if it's actually ramping up. Uh, like some, you need some really like tight shit. But I've played a lot of platformers, so I might be able to do it.
like how they're stuck. But from what I've seen, I, I have a feeling you might be... If you actually see me play it, you might actually be interested. In that game. Especially because it has a... It probably has a high difficulty, like a high skill ceiling. Those buggy looking eyes, you mean the ones that rapidly getting bigger and bigger? Oh shit! Uh oh. I told you, you shouldn't have trots so loudly. It's always feet that are causing trouble. The Spyro Trilogy Remaster is also pretty difficult. I, rem I don't remember the Spyro games, the original Spyro games being that difficult though. You can die pretty easily if you don't know what, uh, if you don't uh, like doing things too quickly. With great caution, you must threat. There's buzzing brute in the nook ahead. Okay. I have the Spyro Trilogy on Steam, so. So I have the Crash one as well. Like. But I already played Crash 4, it's about time. Could hear the big through the I didn't play the trilogy though. Oh, here we go again. He readied his bow. It was time to finish this once and for all. Uh, it's so weird when you're pointing your bow. It's so weird when you're pointing your bow at it, you think you're gonna hit it, but you actually have to make sure the radical hits it. How am I- okay, um, uh, like, how am I supposed to hit that that quickly if the radical- Yeah, there's no way. This is why you need a mouse and keyboard for this kind of shit. Yeah. There's no way. It's like it, almost impossible to hit the front one. Or I have to make sure my, my reticle is already... Like right in front of me. Still, it's difficult. How did I miss that one? Okay, hold on. Consider miss. Okay, fuck, fuck this. <sighs> okay. Well. Those things are really difficult with mouse. Dude, if I had a mouse, I, I would I would be able to sweep. I'm really skilled with a mouse. Look lucky, Squire. Triumphant. I spent I play a lot of shooters on, on PC. The difference between a stick and a mouse is, is enormous. Like, really.
Okay. We survived the swamps. You know, Moonbeard just said... A uh, jot was off script here. If it turns... It turns out of off script. Doesn't have to mean certain doom. Nope. We figured it out. We improvised. Improvisation. I dig it. Like, like a drum solo. Or a freeform painting. Sounds quite cool, doesn't it? It fits very well with a mobile game. Yeah, I guess. Like I said, it's like WarioWare, but but uh, Zelda-ish. Adventurous, I reunite with my love, Gilead. Two fish sticks. Flodio told me all about how you rescued him. It instantly turned me off that he had to be rescued. <laughs> I'm gonna leave him now. I'm so I'm such an asshole, dude. We thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Hello. I like how it's actually a Freddy one. I'm so glad they found each other. I hope there's like a VOD watcher. I don't I probably there probably isn't. That's gonna come to this part with like full volume headset on. Right, like full volume. And it's gonna jump scare the shit out of that. I'm so glad they found each other. They look happy together. How come? Let's skedaddle. I've seen some people comment and like... I've watched the entire VOD. I've seen, I've seen it before. So... The sun on their faces felt most pleasant as they continued on their way. After some time, they arrived. At Artia. Even watched you all have watched the entire thing. Artia. Okay, so next chapter. Here we are, home sweet home. Greetings, gang. Sorry we lost contact in those Sone swamps. Rune tooth coverage is still rather limited. Whoa! Whoa! Anyway, glad you weren't all Whoa! devoured by leeches. Oh, god damn it. Whoa! Whoa! Yeah! 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 Thanks for the sound. I'm on my way to Archia City. I'll join you shortly. In the meantime, stretch your pins. Take a look around. Wouldn't be a doubt. Whoa! Whoa! Really? Whoa! 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 Yeah! Whoa! Whoa! What's the chances of that actually being whoa? The fuck? That's crazy. That is actually crazy. Hey, mom. Well, I've been, you know, adventuring. Hey, Mr. Light. M Mrs. Lightbrush. Yeah, things have gotten pretty gnarly. Hum Grump is Hum Grump is up to some kind of Hum Grump mischief. Amogus. God damn it! It's a kind of magic. Always is that one. Well, it's good to see you all, including you, Jot. Read your latest adventure. Quite the page turner. A bit where you leap. Lep <laughs> Mom Jots heard it already. Right, right, right. Violet, listen, your Uncle Umber, he's got himself in a pickle. A pickle right No, just kidding. Sounds like he needs some help. Could you go talk to him? Wasn't there an episode of Rick and Morty where he turns himself into a pair of sexy legs? 
Like how the NPC reacted with it always is to the Amogus sound. <laughs> it figures. Okay, mom, I'm on it. What's the Mausolina doing? Oh, Mausolina. They said Mausolina. Mausolina. Mona Lisa. Mosalina, I said. Jesus, my my brain is like pulling a goddamn stroke, dude. The plucky squire, how nice to see you here. You know, many people come here to see my my smile. Try not to get too self-conscious about it. No, it's the Mosalina. Now it's just I, I just changed history. Yeah, the painting is gonna moan. What? Hey, look, Morty! I'm a leg! A leg, Morty! Yeah. My reboinks, my little round piggies. They started behaving strangely a day ago. Rolling around like the speed of sound, like squishy pink bowling balls. They busted clean out of the farm. Will you find my reboinks and return them to me? They are sacks of them. Oh, what the fuck. Okay, hold on. My brain needs to be washed. Like, exp like, exp oh my god. Like flushed. My brain is fucking flushed. Cooked right now. Bricked. Like a console brick. Why is there so many Mona Lisas? This season I'm going for a vivid colors, okay? It's whatever, man. If this is your emo face, then just say so. Warhol. I'm just a copy of a genuine article. Or is it the other way around? It doesn't matter anyway. Don't worry, you only have 15 minutes left. I don't know if I'm gonna make it. Can I change my color palette here? Hey, pig! I'm just gonna verbally assault you. Yeah. Nice. I can actually make pick noises. You're the famous plucky squire, aren't you? Love to make a thousand pictures of your face. Okay, you're not allowed. You hear me? This juice is delicious. We'll probably make quite a nice Pikmin too. Okay. Dude has alcohol in his juice. Fruit is the key to health and happiness. Well, then give me some. I'm I'm depressed. Okay. <laughs> I'm just I'm just be <laughs> fucking comedy or uh, fucking worst comedy ever.
He wants to do a lucky Rick face reveal. Everything looks better covered in dots. I'm trying to cover Archer in dots, but the groundskeeper won't let me. You have some ish fucking issues, bro. We'll do water. Beautiful blue water. Holy pets, quite like those two. Okay. I'm not here. And yet you are. What do I mean? I do not mean anything. It's all a mystery. It's fiction. It's like that one, that one, um, that one video. This guy's like that one video. It's fiction. It never happened. <laughs> it's fiction. Uh, whatever it was, it never happened. It's fake. It's a fabrication. This one. It's false. No way. Not this time. We created it. Not this time. No. Not this time. It's totally made up. Pure fiction. It's fiction. It's fiction. We made it up. We made this one up. It's a made up tale. It's a total fabrication. It never happened. It, it never, never happened. happened. <laughs> <laughs> Sunflowers are beautiful. Truly love nature. You will find beauty everywhere. Where's your ear? Van Gogh. Goh. Van Gogh. <laughs> the Dutch just seems so aggressive, the Dutch language. Same as the German one, it's kind of the same thing. We always sound like... Way more aggressive than, than other, like, countries. That's how you pronounce it, though. People say Vincent from Go or something. We say Goch. That's what we say. None of that pussy bullshit. No. I've seen some, like, news. You know those people, like, um... Riding on, uh, those, those fat bikes or whatever it's called, like? Fat bikes, those bikes with the, the thick wheels. In the Netherlands, that seems to be a problem now for some reason. I, <laughs> I hate fat bikes. They're, they're ugly. I mean, some of them, I've, I think, I've seen a, some, I've seen a few of them that, that don't look that bad, but they do look out of place, yes. On like a fucking cycle way, but I think just. Like, the, the rules they're taking right now, I've, I've seen some, like, news, like, I was just, like, downstairs and I was watching some news and they were talking about fed bikes and I was like, okay. So, they want you to wear, like, helmets and shit, I've heard, for, for fed bikes, <laughs> but, but electric bikes go just as fast. So, you have to do that for that now as well in the Netherlands. This, le this country is going to shit. Absolutely. Just hire the, the, the age restriction on these things. On electrical bikes to like 14 plus or something. Oh, damn. Nice trippy... <laughs> nice trippy uh, pigs. Like, me personally, when I would, like, get a bike, I probably would be a uh, lazy shit that also gets, like, a fat bike or something. Or, like, an electrical bike. Something around those lines. I don't give a shit what it looks like. If it gets me faster from point A to point B, I, w I would get that. That's just me, but... But it's like a problem with it or something that they can't go too fast or something. People like uh, adjust the settings of the thing, I guess. Make it faster. I mean. 
something along those lines, I think. I don't know. Oh, well. Neither do I. So. Why is your face censored? You haven't seen me. Okay. I hide in the trees until I spot my moment. Okay. Similar hat, but this isn't Mr. Magri. Glitch bird. Korok ripoffs. <laughs> Two remaining. Yeah, but they're over here, though. How do we get... So, like no way to like go I'm not a dog Why does he talk now? What the fuck? It's hard to say. Can I help you? It's your doc. You're sitting on something quite important. Oh, this is a doc's owner. Okay. You have any uh, advice on how to shift him? An interesting question. My mind, unfortunately, is a blank. I need some inspiration to spark some joy. Hey, man! And I need an object to seat my inspiration. I need... I need an apple. Ock. I got you an apple. If you're hungry, you can just nibble on the furniture. the fruit store again it wasn't over here fruit store somewhere around yeah no well look who we have here hello penny hello clipso long time no see splat Hey, Mr. Barry. 
And by what can I do for you? Should I, the thing is, we're looking for an apple. Pretty shiny, huh? It's a good apple, that is. You know, my apples, I'm surrounded by fruit. You can have this one for your charge. Brilliant, thank you, Mr. Barry. See, they're gonna steal it, aren't they? Hello again, Splat. Nice hat, Splat. Trying the whole magic thing. Just... <laughs> just kill them. Slice their gut open with the sword. Make it a horror game. At least you haven't turned yourself into a frog yet. I'm not so sure. Take a closer look at her, her face. She, they're gonna take the apple from us, aren't they? Never mind. You flooded the whole classroom with multicolored paint. Okay. People couldn't hear properly for weeks. Paint in the airs, that's when I become known as Splats. They never let me live it down. I mean, we all make mistakes, you know. No need to keep bragging on someone for their catastrophes. Jesus. Mishaps. I'm getting more tired of the second. Anyway. That was a long time ago. Doesn't bother me anymore. Not a big deal. Nope. Yeah, it still does. Come on, let's go. See Mr. Magri. I like how he puts it on his head. Goodbye, doggo. It's just that I'm tired. It's not like I'm getting bored. Just, I'm, I'm tired, man. Because that was also like a reason why I wanted to do um, the Metroidvania game over this. Because that Metroidvania game is only like f three or four hours in length. Compared to this game being like 10, 7 to 10 or something. Depending how much you do. And knowing me, I just fucking skipped through everything, so. Would you say you didn't notice the damage input? Can, can it be because the enemies get stronger at this part? You see the frame skipping? Ha. 
It's like very jittery. Okay, let's turn it off in the settings. There weren't a lot of uh, graphic settings, I think. No. I don't mind it though, it's not that bad. It just makes it, it this does make it easier to stream though. But then again, when we play like Bendy in the ink machine or whatever, because I bought it, so. I haven't even looked up the gameplay, I just bought it. <laughs> I don't know what I'm getting into, and that's the best thing, I guess. For Halloween, so. It looked interesting enough. No, 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 I didn't look into it at all. I don't know what the fuck am I getting into, and that's the most funny thing about it, isn't it? If I play it in Halloween, if I don't know what the fuck the game's about... Like, look at this, holy shit. It, it really shows here. My god, my eyes. I think it's just the frame rate dropping. Jesus. Huh. I guess they didn't bother to optimize it that well for console. I don't want- I don't want to know what- this, this is on Switch, right? This game. Look at this. Oh my god, it's actually, fu it's actually fucking with my eyes, dude. I guess they didn't bother to optimize it completely. Like, you wouldn't say this game wouldn't be able to run on this. How hot is the thing? Let's see. I mean, it's blowing off hot air from the top, but... It's fine. My PC blows some, like, air that hot sometimes when I play really, like... Demanding games. And, um... The frame rate's just fine, so... I mean, I have a feeling... I don't wanna even want to know what your laptop feels like. Yeah, exactly. Laptops are worse. That's why I don't game on them. You should, um... Like, for real, when you- when your laptop finally, like, oh, finally, like, uh, it's a pretty recent laptop, right? Like, a, a year or two, maybe? Or, like, a year old, I don't know. Probably- is it, if that's, like, a 36 year, I'm guessing 2022? 2021? Yeah. 2022, 2021, somewhere around there? Am I correct? Probably. I mean, you don't know when you got your laptop? Yeah, so 2021. I see. I think that's the same year I got mine as well. It has like an i7 and a 3060. It's an MSI laptop mine. And my dad's currently like playing some games on it and so on. Like his, his laptop is kind of outdated. And he, ha he asked if I had the replacement laptop. I was like, you know, whatever. You can use it. It's like a fucking 1500 euro laptop. What the fuck? It's like a 1500 euro laptop, but whatever. You can use it. Hello? 
It would have been really handy to stream PC games on, though, if I could c uh, connected the... You know. If I connected the, the capture card to my laptop, which I've done before. Ah. Like I've streamed, um, last time I used it was, I think, um, last year with, um, little nightmares, I guess. Okay. Oh, I see. I had to walk up. Duck! There you go. Every game has ducks. It's just goaded animals. an acer okay an acer predator or whatever it's called nitro oh yeah nitro that's the name i think a friend of mine also had an acer nitro But I suggest whenever um, your laptop starts getting like good performances on games, newer games and shit, and you want a better device, just building a laptop or like a PC yourself, a good one, at least with some good specs, it will save you some money. Actually. Okay, hold on. There we go. Tilt gauntlets. With these mysterious gloves, he has the power to move the world itself. Use LT and RT to win manipulating the book. Another of Moonbeard's magical items. I believe you will find the tilt gauntlets more beneficial and rather fun to, if you enjoy tilting things. Really depends on the mechanics hold up. <laughs> I'll magic up a portal to help you on your way. All right. But yeah. Ah. Uh. The 3D seconds are the highlight of the game. Like, you know, so far for me, it doesn't really matter, because both pl play the exact same. Let's take these tilt gondolas for a spin. You should be able to tilt the books itself with LTRT, okay.
Okay, that's pretty funny. No. Hey, we ain't done here yet. I want these piggies to roll out as well. Then you should play It Takes Two. Easier. Thanks for the follow. How you doing? Well, how long are you playing? Um, two hours twenty minutes. Uh, minus the the, the eight or ten minutes for the wait screen at the beginning. So let's say two hours and ten minutes. But. Um, overall, this is chapter, this is like the, this is your actual voice? Uh, how do you mean? You think I'm AI? <laughs> Artificial intelligence? <laughs> yes, this is my actual voice. <laughs> Sounds like Vine Sauce Joel, shut the fuck up. Constantly. Dude, I wanna. Can I tilt the book again? Yeah. Your voice is so good. I wish I had that voice. Ah, come on. Your voice is pretty good, right? No way. No way you have. You have. You. you yeah, I, I bet you have a good voice. It doesn't really do anything. I'm actually Dutch, so that's why I'm, I might seem a little, like, strange. Like, most Dutch people have, like, a really strong, like... <laughs> You'll know when they're Dutch. With most of them. You have a question? Uh, sure. Oh, wow, there's just circles there without. Really? Bruh. <laughs> A modular and rigor. And I create all sorts of Twitch stuff. But what is a, a mo modular and rigor? What exactly do you do? Like you make like models or something? Model and rig means I can do rig in a model. Okay. 
All my piggies are back safe and sound. Violet, Violet's unusual looking friends. I mean, I appreciate the suggestion, um, but uh, I don't need it. I really don't need it, so. We have, I already have some animations and, and all that kind of stuff and models and logos and, and character models. I already have that, so I don't really need it, to be honest, so. I appreciate the suggestion, though, and the follow. As a token of my appreciation, please take this. Yeah. Art, don't tell me it's just artwork. <laughs> A model can attract people. I know. I know. You mean like VTuber stuff? Like, oh, that's what you're talking about? I'm not a VTuber or like, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm just a normal, like, streamer. Nah, I, I, I ain't doing VTubing. And channel artists, and money, and bitches, and hellcats. <laughs> Yes, I don't really do VTube in, uh, that's not my thing. I would rather probably just put a face cam on then, instead. I mean, you could do a one-off, like, what, a PNG tuber thing? I'm, I'm, dude, I'm, really? That's just not me, man. Like, actually not. Could you even imagine me doing that? I remember you were debating, but we all what happened whoever came up with that suggestion. Yes. We know who, who I know. That was before you joined. Yeah, that was a moderator. Who is still in, who is still in my Steam friend list and is still friends with me on Discord, by the way. No, it's not Robin. Robin is still a moderator. We had like a moderator who, um, controversies, uh, I wouldn't say controversies. It's more like, um, the mod didn't agree. Or like, I don't know, what was it about? Was it about football? I don't even know. <laughs> Michael. <laughs> I think it was about football or something. We had like a disagreement and the, the person just got like a massive outburst. Like... Like he just got mad about something. I was like, okay, we're just, jo we're just, we're just jo joking around. And he took it very seriously and he was like, okay. And I was like, okay, okay. Whatever. And he left the server and then I was like, okay, whatever. Uh, suit yourself, I guess. Uh, I think that's how the Messi, uh, the, the Lionel Messi emote in our Discord server. <laughs> I think that's how that one came to be. I actually turned it into an emote because of that. Young adventurers, good to see you all together. You there, glad you're all in shape. Better comb your hair and straighten your pocket squares. We're about to meet royalty. It was us talking about Messi, and he got pissed talking about... Yeah, something, something along the lines. I, I, I just fucked, I just fuck typed something without thinking... Too, like, big about it. 
And he was like really sensitive to that or something. And I was like, okay. My bad. But he didn't care. He was just, <laughs> he was out. Okay. He left. I'm actually, I'm actually curious. Which messy emote? Uh, there's like one messy emote where it just looks, where it just, it's like kind of like the Aaron face in the Discord. It was a little gag of Messi and many other football players. Send it in meme chat. Okay, hold on. If I can find it. <laughs> that fucking emo, dude. <laughs> Queen Chroma will gladly see you now. Wait, that's messy? Yes, that's a um, PES model. Like the football game, you know, PES, Pro Evolution Soccer, whatever it's called. PES model of Messi, a really ugly one. <laughs> I was sending those pictures and I said something along the lines, like, uh, the dudes do don't get any pussy or something, <laughs> something stupid like that. I don't know what I said. Looking like this, that's what I said, something along the lines of that. And he, he, didn't, he didn't like that because he is from Argentina. And he left. I don't know exactly what I said, but something along the lines of that. And he said, yeah, I don't know. It was weird. What if he's still followed? I have a feeling he might still be followed. And it sometimes just is in the chat, but doesn't say anything. I just have a feeling that sometimes. What if? He just, I didn't ban him. I'm not like that guy. I'm not, I'm not holding grudges. So against somebody. Bru the streamer that gifted me a sub, yeah, but that was like a furry. I didn't even know that. Okay. Elmo, allow allow me to tell you the story that one time I raided a furry. One time we ended the stream. I found a streamer without looking at their like um stream, just the title, and the game was the same as mine. He was playing Astrobot, so I was like, you know, he only has like three viewers or something. Let's uh let's drop him a raid. Turns out it was like the biggest furry ever. End of story. Don't worry about blowing her mind. She knows the score. Let's go. Let's go see you. Okay, can we say can we leave it here? Save it here? Cause we're already half past uh, one right now. The queen is on the castle balcony. I will leave you there. Yeah, just walk there. I'll walk there next episode. I like how the characters don't automatically walk with them. It's fine by me. Uh, is this a safe point? Last save, five minutes, four seconds. Whoa, 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 what? Hey, now. What's the fuck? Well, then whatever, I'll just play five minutes. I want to see how far it puts me back. It's five minutes only, but that's uh, quite a big, ta big time, actually. Hold on. It puts me back in the, out in the outside of the town, doesn't it? Oh, okay, it puts me back there. Nice, whatever, that's fine. Okay, I just wanted to see. You pinked on the thing. Hey, wait, the messages are still there? <laughs> the messages are still there? <laughs> what the- <laughs> like, Mo like Mojo ever- like immediately goes, whatever happened to- Okay, that's what I said. Okay. <laughs> All 
All right. <laughs> oh damn! The fact that he got pissed about that, I didn't know. I didn't know it was it was laying that deep to the guy, man. Yeah, yeah. I don't wanna. I don't wanna. I'm not saying the name out loud because I don't wanna dox any names. So I don't want any harassment to like people. No, none. So. But yeah. Um. Wow, well, we barely have any viewers, so I'm not gonna do a raid today. But uh, yeah, I'm I'm gonna dive into bed because I feel like I've played enough today. I'll be back with Zelda tomorrow, um, around like 9 p.m. I think, and uh, yeah, we'll have a good time then. I don't know. I, I was thinking of early streams as well, but I don't think they make sense because you guys are all in school and shit, right? Right now. So. But yeah. Um. I hope you all have a good one. And uh. I'll see you on the next one.